Our next guest, uh, I'm sure enjoys Old Trapper Beef Jerky. Who doesn't? He also enjoys winning Super Bowls. He's done it twice. He's played his entire career with the New England Patriots and most importantly right now is nominated for the Walter Payton NFL Man of the Year Award. Welcome back to Good Morning Football. Cornerback, Jonathan Jones. What's yeah. up, JJ? How are you doing? What's going on? What's going on? Doing good. You're a friend of ours, man. You have been for a long time, which is why we're very excited about what's going on with you right now. Less than two weeks ago, Patriots owner Robert Kraft announced in front of the whole team that you were this team's, this year's Walter Payton Man of the Year nominee. Describe them. What was it like, man? Man, you're in a squad meeting uh, in front of the whole team, and he gets up. Um, and he says, hey, you're this year's nominee uh, for the Walter Payton Man of the Year. Uh, and in front of your teammates, because they see what you do uh, week in and week out, not only on the field, uh, but off the field. Uh, and this organization prides itself on the work they do in the community. So uh, to be nominated uh, is, is truly an honor. Well, congratulations, Jonathan. Over your career, you became the first male ambassador for I Play Like a Girl. You also established the Jonathan Jones Next Step Foundation for Youth. What does it mean to give back to the communities that helped you in your football journey? Uh, it means everything to me, uh, honestly. I always pride myself saying uh, I'm a product of help. You know, someone either gave their time or their money uh, along my journey for me to be here. So it's only full circle for me to, to be able to give back to the youth. Uh, and cliche, you know, they're the future. So to invest in them and to, to give them opportunities to, to come full circle and, and to live up their full potential, it's honestly, uh, it's a blessing. And it generally is a blessing to be a blessing and, and help other people. Uh, uh, along that journey and I'm excited to continue to keep doing that. It's an awesome honor and you, you've been in the league for a while now. It's eight years and you've been coached by one man, Bill Belichick. Obviously you've seen the reports. We're not going to be talking about this. This is about you, the Walter Payton Man of the Year. I would ask you this though. This final month, these final few weeks, is this Patriots team still kind of together and trying to get these victories and really galvanized around what you're hearing on the outside? Uh, I mean, honestly, we are. Uh, you kind of shift your focus. You know, when you're eliminated from the playoffs, uh, it becomes personal. Uh, each week, is it's not about the, the postseason, but uh, about pride. Uh, it's the opportunity to take pride in yourself, you know, as a team, as a unit, uh, and to come out and, and play together. I mean, honestly, uh, my eight years here have been phenomenal under coach. I've learned so much, um, and, and it's been a great opportunity just to, to be a player here, um, the highs and the lows, and, and I think uh, moving forward, you just continue to, to work off that and know that every year is not going to be a great year um, but you continue to fight so these next few weeks you know as a team you come together uh, backs against the wall and just just fight just fight I mean I think that's all you can do Jonathan your defense has been playing lights out the last couple of weeks uh, but this Sunday you guys have Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs coming to town take us through the preparation week is there anything different anything you're doing extra because Mahomes is coming into town I mean, one of the best to do it. I mean, honestly saying that um, because he is a phenomenal talent. Uh, the one thing about him, they're going to uh, push the ball down the field. He's going to make extended plays and, and run around. And, and you have to be on key, you know, all throughout the game. And the thing about them is, you know, they can be either blow you out from the beginning of the game or, or hang around and in the end um, come back and win in 15 seconds. So they're, they're that type of team um, with him at the quarterback that you just have to stay on it and play entire 60-minute football game uh, and continue to fight. That, that's that's one thing they're going to do. They have a, a wear around the team, you know, even defensively. Uh, they have a lot of good talent from the cornerback to the front seven. Um, they, they do a good job, so it's, it's going to be a good game. Well, if they happen to score a touchdown against you, don't worry. They probably line up wrong. It'll be called back. Don't worry about it. That's last <laughs> week. We'll see how you do this week. Um, listen, you played four seasons with Tom Brady. Uh, you won two Super Bowls yeah. with Brady. Get a load of this. Yeah. Next year, Netflix is producing a comedy special roasting Tom Brady. He's just going to sit up there and everyone's just going to make jokes, busting chops. It's called the greatest roast of all time. We're not even sure who's going to be there yet. If you were called upon to make an appearance and go up, what would your angle be to roast Brady? Like, how do you get Brady? Where's his weak spot? 
That's that's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, I don't want that gig. Like, what, what do you say? You, you're the winningest quarterback. You're a handsome man, married to a supermodel for years. I mean, where where do you find a place to get in? I don't know that he's slow. Uh, he doesn't run well. Who cares? He's a <laughs> he's won uh, seven Super Bowls. I, don't, I, I generally don't know what where they're going to dig in on him. And uh, I'd be excited to see it because I yeah, definitely don't want that gig to try to try to get at Tom. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't see a, a, a kink in his armor. Yeah, once you get past the year slow and the, the Eli Manning jokes after a while, it's kind of dried up. Like, there's not a lot of, really lot isn't of we, we, We're not even allowed to use the combine picture anymore, too. Like, I don't know. So you yeah. got to throw that yeah. one out. It's kind of he, He's won at life. He's won at life. <laughs> he really has. Um, and so are you. And all the work you do in the community, that's why one of the reasons we love you so much, man. You're an old friend. You'll always be welcome here. Jonathan Jones from the Patriots, guys. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks, JJ. Thanks for having well, me. Coming up, what would